This video will take a look at the digital and analog input triggers on Mosaic. The digital input trigger allows you to trigger off of the state of a contact closure, either locally on the Mosaic hardware itself, or utilizing one of the Rios. The first thing you'll need to choose is what device you're actually talking to, whether it is a local device or one of the Rio input objects. If you select one of the Rios, you'll also have to choose a specific device. If you leave it back at local, it'll make all the assumptions for you. The next thing you'll do is select the input. Based off of which physical piece of hardware you're working with, the input amounts may change. If you would like to trigger off of any of the inputs changing, you can leave this set at any. Otherwise, set it to a specific input. You then have the option to trigger based off when the contact goes low or high for your particular application. Once you've configured the input trigger, you can add whatever conditions or actions are required. The analog input trigger functions in a very similar method. First, select your device, either local or exterior. Then select an input, or leave it all. Unlike having a physical high or low, like digital input, analog input gives you the option for enters in range or changes in range, and allows you to set a percentage for the minimum and a percentage for the maximum. So for instance, if I need a trigger when my analog signal goes between 50% and 100, I can come in here and set a minimum and a maximum level, and make sure this is enters range. This is useful for when working with things like wind sensors or photo sensors.